Motorists in Benin City have voiced their dissatisfaction over the sudden hike in fuel prices and scarcity of the commodity. When our news crew drove around Benin City Metropolis, it was observed that most of the filling stations were closed, an indication of the unavailability of the product at the NMPC Mega Filling Station on Sapale Road, where they just received two tankers of the product. There was a long queue of vehicles in a scene that has become all too common. The motorists were groaning. Some of the motorists who spoke to our news crew expressed deep frustration over the development and called on the president to make urgent intervention to ameliorate the plight of the mass public. It, it, it's not easy. It's really affecting us. Because if you calculate your, your transport daily, from uh, road to Ringo, this is okay. But from Ringo to Dakar, Sapia Road, show. 1,800, 200, you spend about 2,000 something. You that is even spending uh, 600, 800 and copying, you have people spending 1,000 naira to that pass, coming back 1,000, 2,000 naira. And then, I've been here since yesterday, 7 p.m. You can imagine the number of hours now, up to the night, the cars in here. All true, they've been waiting. Only for us to be told this morning that they can't sell to us because they don't have enough stock that will go around, that we have to wait. And since then, we've been waiting since morning. It's going to be like the transport, the fuel, everything. The fuel is exactly, is really, really affecting us, especially the transport. Because, because you know, where I'm actually going, I actually spend normal 300, 200 naira. So now I'm actually spending 500 naira to go to that place. I don't really know where, where, like, where we are actually going in the country. All we just want is just good governance. It's not really friendly at all at all. There are some people who have been here since 2 a.m. Since even some people who left here. Some people who left their car by 11 p.m. yesterday to ensure that they get here. Some people are not waiting since morning. So as you can see, it's really terrible. It's telling on every one of us. We are not happy. Seriously. The scarcity has also caused considerable concern to other Nigerians who also called for swift action. To the government just to make it easy for everybody. They should make the fair be easy, like if you don't get 500 naira, we take 500 naira, we try our best. But 1000 naira is too much. Right now, they are sending a fair 1300 naira. In this NFPC now, they are sending it 885 naira. You can see the country is very worse, my brother and my sister. Please try and reduce the price of this fair issue because it's really affecting us. Transportation is the one issue. So, if you bring this, if you want to tell you, say, uh, do you know how much I take on that one? Beg the federal government for actually look into this issue because I uh, found some rumor that said it's not his fault. Um, you cannot be the one, be the one the head of the nation and something is going on and you just feel a concern and see nothing is happening so i will beg him to use this as an avenue to look into this issue and see how you can reduce and make nigeria a better place for the nigerian to do meanwhile some of the managers of the filling stations without the products who spoke off camera confirmed that they had run out of the products they appealed for immediate intervention to alleviate the suffering caused by the fuel scarcity and restore normalcy to their daily lives victoria okwamedwa reporting for us tv news <laughs>